G'day everyone and welcome to Diamond Art with Dell. Today we are doing an unbagging video. Um, I have a very well sealed package here. Uh, it's got the garbage bag. I've got, I don't know, probably half a roll of sticky tape stuff on it. So it's really, really well sealed. And um, I believe this one's from AliExpress. I'm hoping anyway I'll unbag it and we'll find out very, very soon. Uh, I can also feel that it's got a lot of... Um, that chewy bubbly stuff I don't even know where to start to open this anyway how are we all today I hope you're all having a great day um, getting some diamond painting done enjoying some videos whatever it is you're doing I hope it's going well for you in your world right now alrighty I think I found a spot to open it Jeez, I better be careful with these scissors eh? it's just shoving them in there I could be cutting things I shouldn't be cutting definitely well sealed um, well protected I'm going just by my emails as this is the package from Aliexpress I ordered um, I was actually kind of wow I was actually kind of surprised to see this come in the post when I did because it was rather quick for Aliexpress I do find that they are just a bit sometimes a bit on the slower side than most places I don't know if that's just the particular companies I buy from or it's AliExpress or just the distance it's got to travel I don't know what it is but it's a thing that's all I know all right let's get rid of this garbage bag oh, maybe struggle is real I just want to show you what I got because it's all related to diamond painting do 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 all right, so plastic bag be gone. Ooh, this looks good. Look at that cool bubbly stuff. What is that called? That tubey bubble wrap, isn't it? It's like that tubey bubble wrap. And I've got a whole ton of it on there. Look at it. They're well, it's well wrapped up. Whoa, take noises. Let's just snip that, shall we? All right, so it's been well packaged. I'm very, very excited and happy to see that it is because it is an item that could break so I'm glad to see that you know a lot of protection has been put in place to make sure my item arrives to me safely so this one um, oh, is got more bubbly stuff this is the case this is the bag it comes with and somewhere along here I can open this I believe here we go maybe maybe could be oh like an envelope I get it now there we go so it's got like a little it's like the long bubble wrap thing but it's an envelope how good is that that's a great idea that is a really neato idea to put them in so it's just packaging it's, I know but it's neat I like that it's so protected wonderful excellent pro I'm gonna throw it on the floor now okay here we go guys this is it this is what I bought myself now you um, you may already have one I did unfortunately I've had mine for quite a long time now it is a light board that's right now this is the a4 size and I'm kind of kicking myself because they had a deal where you add a little bit more things like five six bucks and I got an A5 size with this deal um, so I'm kind of kicking myself I didn't get it because now I'm thinking it would have been better for like my traveler smaller you know than this just fits in my bag well but I could have had that little bit smaller one it would have been perfect for traveling just anyway opportunity missed I'll try and put as much details in the description down below for you guys about this product um, Aliexpress you can't do links I don't know why I can't do it so sorry but I will tell you what store and how much etc I pay for it at the time so you can have a look for yourself and that way you should be able to you know do the little what's it called oh magnifying glass thing you know when you search stuff and put that into the Aliexpress and that store should come up and you should be able to find it easy good -o. um okay so what have I got this copy board instructions all right cool um, details are there as such 
um, yeah okay so it's 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 a light board okay it's an A4 light board um, I'll just check out what else it what is that? that's the film oh protection film got it don't need that anymore so you get a nice protection film it's actually quite thick actually it's thick thick plastic quite a thick plastic cover you can go over there so that my light board is really nice and straight really nice and clean no scratches no marks no nothing it is looking wonderful these tools are great for especially certain dime paintings it seem to be very dark with symbols or anything like that and just generally if you're working a long time on a project um, I find that yeah it just helps relieve your eyes now that in itself is cool it also comes with your little lead now you probably got a hundred of these anyway around the house so don't stress too much um, USB to mini USB I will right, just find some power source and that's what the, I would have been smart to bring power with me wouldn't it and I have got some under the table I suppose I could reach from there let's see all right so I've got my lead and what I've done is I've just nicked off for a minute and I've got myself my little power pack now these are a little power pack you can get from JB Hi-Fi I got this one from um, a lot of computer places you can buy them online etc etc you can even go to Kmart and get them now like they're literally everywhere and it just depends on what size you want and how long you want your you know power to last for um, this one has a little digital display so it tells me that I've got 100% in there at the moment and I can put USB and mini USB plugs in the end there you go so what I use this for is I take this for when I'm traveling so then I've got my own power to like my power board or I can charge my phone I can do lots of things with it but it's kind of handy if there's not an outlet or you may be at someone's house that you don't really feel the 100% comfortable about asking them, okay can I plug in charge my phone or whatever's going on okay so that's what this is so I'm going to just I'll get the right end what I want to do is plug my USB end in there right then I can turn it on little button it's got a little button so here yeah, this is a tutorial using a power pack as well as an unboxing now and in the side here is where you just plug your iPad iPad your light pad and then voila it works now I'm not sure if you can see that at the moment because I've got really daylight but you can see it is functioning it's got one two three lights on it is working really well um, even with full daylight going on it's got a nice glow about it so I am very very happy it works it's got a nice dirty plug there um, you can use this in either portrait or landscape mode it wouldn't really matter whatever you like so this is my replacement because this plug here after a long time traveling is very very loose now and it's my cords falling out and it was just bugging me so much that I had to just buy another one so I thought I'd do a little bit of an unboxing of it as well and there you go you can use a travel pack to take one of these with you anywhere and because I do take it anywhere this actually came with its own little travel bag so how cool is that this is the other winner that I why I chose to buy this one because it wasn't much difference in price I thought what the why not you know these are pretty cheap I um, 25 bucks or something like that I think something like that um, at the time I can't remember there we go we got our own little canvas bag it's got like a, a oh, it's hard to explain but like a little liner lip there so you can put something on one side it's got a little bit of padding not a lot not like a computer bag or anything but it's definitely got a light bit of padding it's very neat and clean um, it's pink it's a nice soft pink moving bag made in China I don't know what that means but anyway there you are but it's a nice canvas bag it's got a nice zip it opens so three quarters there we go we can actually see inside it has got like a little side pocket there so I suppose you can give you somewhere to put your lead as well as your board and that will fit just snug 
in there as such. Um, yes, you take your power lead with you. You can probably put your power pack in there as well. I wouldn't, but there we go. And you just pop that all in there. Simple enough. Zip it all up. And there we are. We have a nice, cute little travel bag. Um, cute little travel bag for your light pad. There you go. And yeah, it's got, it serves a little bit of protection. It's going to stop from getting scratched, etc. So that was really cool. Um, you can get the light pad just on its own from the store or the light pad and the small one. Um, this one was a package and it came with that light pad and that bag for the price. I think it was, a, I can't remember. It was about 25, 26 bucks. Um, free postage, I'm pretty sure because I go for that sort of stuff all the time. Uh, and it was rather quick to get here, it was a couple of weeks, so I was really very, very surprised um, on all that sort of side of it. So, uh, yeah, I'll try and add the name of the store down below for you guys to check it out. Um, but yeah, there you go. That is my new light pad, and it's got this little travel case. I kind of wish I went for the upgrade and got the little A5 one, because I said literally it was like about maybe six, seven dollars more. So I think now I wish I'd done that. But all in all, this is what I needed. I've got what I wanted. I'm very happy with it. I like the little extra bag. It feels good to be able to chuck that in there. Now it's safe and protected. I can put that in my bag with all my other diamond painting goodies, my canvas and my drills, and I'm good to go. So this is very cute. It's got a beautiful zip. Um, no problems there. I really, really wonder sometimes with zips, but this one's really good. Like a little canva bag, handles. It's, it's neatly sewn. So, yeah, it's a nice little bonus bag. It keeps my cord where I need it to. That's another thing, too. I, I have a tendency to misplace my lead. So at least I know that's in the bag. And I could probably pop that in there, too, if I really wanted to. Because it's got that little side pocket. I reckon you could put a power pack in there and be okay. Let's see, shall we? Makes it really heavy though. <laughs> but yeah, you can definitely do that too. So, um, yeah, look, you you can probably put a little bit more in there than just the light pad, but I wouldn't. I'd be scared to put too much in there just in case it bangs and cracks it. You know, it's inside the bag; it's not going to get protected as easy as it does for the outside. So it is a possibility not my recommendations but a possibility to do that as well there we go so that is a very cute um, carry bag new light pad for me uh, I wanted to share that that is really 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 great I'm really happy with that purchase um, I really appreciated how well they wrapped it up too because Something like this sort of product going through the mail, who knows what sort of travel and, and journey it has to it gets to your home and all that. But yeah, so they've done a really great job on the packaging side of things. So I'm very pleased with how well, um, whatever that stuff's called. What? This tubey envelope thing was just amazing. I like that idea. I thought that was a great thing. And to be honest, you could you could use just the store your light pad in too if you wanted to um, use it inside the canvas bag. I suppose it will all fit, will it? No. Go back in there. Yes, in a pinch, you can put that back in there with a little bit of encouragement. So you could use it as as well as an outside extra protection cover, if you so wish. So there you go. Um, that's pretty much it for this video. It's only a short one, but I wanted to unbag that light pad. These are really good to use on your canvases. I just find some of them have got either very dark symbols or it's very small, the symbols and things on here. We were looking at really fine detail. So it just helps um, not strain my eyes so much when I've got a light pad, I can just find the symbols I'm looking for easier. And I can diamond paint quicker by using 
a light pad as well. So it's just a handy tool and it's got a cute little bag. How cool is that? Anyway, so that is one of my um, uh, unbagging of diamond painting equipment, I suppose, or I don't know what to call it. <laughs> my mind's at a loss at the moment. But yeah, it is definitely um, going to be well used and loved as much as I did my past one. So I'm going to leave it there, guys. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Stay well and be safe. I hope you enjoy my videos. And if you are, please like, subscribe if you're new. Comment down below what you think. And um, hit that notification bell so you know when I upload next. Until next time, guys, stay well and safe, as I said. And be your life beautiful with Diamond Art Estelle. Signing out. Have a great day, guys. I'll see you on the next video. Bye for now.